Welcome to Stornoway Marina. Stornoway is an all-weather marina that is relatively easy to access in most conditions. The docks are spacious and in good condition, and there are robust cleats that are well-spaced. There are electrical posts on the pontoons, and they have both 16 and 32 amp plugs. The entrance to the marina has a gate with a keypad to enter, and right next to it is a place for trash and recycling. The laundry is located in a building at the end of the quay. There are two large washing machines and dryers. It's three pounds to wash and one pound per 15 minutes to dry. In the other direction, there are two large containers where the bathrooms are located, one side for women and the other for men, and these are accessed via a keypad on the door. Both the men's and the women's bathrooms are almost identical. There's a room on the end with two toilets, two sinks, and a wall-mounted hair dryer. Heading back, there are three private shower rooms with benches and hooks. Showers are one pound for six minutes and the temperature and water pressure are good. If you need some provisions, there's a small but well-stocked co-op grocery store right across the street from the marina. They have a good selection of fruit and vegetables, there are vegetarian options and fresh flowers. There's a meat and dairy section, and also dry goods and toiletries. And of course, a variety of drinks, alcohol or alcohol-free, so you can raise a glass of cheer with your new Scottish friends. If you need a cash machine, there's one right outside the co-op and another just around the corner at the bank. There's a chandlery called the Fisherman's Co-op. They're within easy walking distance of the marina and they have a selection of items. There are lines and hoses and bottom paint, fishing gear, lures and nets. They have foul weather gear, bilge pumps, and even something to help keep you clean while you're changing that bilge pump. The marina offices are located here, just past the chandlery, and I cannot say enough nice things about everyone who works there. They are lovely and helpful, and a large part of why we love Stornoway so much. The fuel dock is located here, just on the corner. It's fairly easy to dock here whenever you need to. However, it is much easier at high tide. I recommend doing that if you're able. Stornoway is a working harbor, which means you'll be sharing the inner harbor with a lot of fishing boats, which we think makes it even better. You might even run across some of the crew when you're walking by. There's more to Stornoway than the marina. This was a festival weekend with bands and people coming in from all over the world, but even on a regular day. Stop in at the Blue Lobster for a coffee and the best pastries in town. You can't beat the location right across from the marina. Care for a wee dram? Pop into the Island Spirit. They have something for everyone. Be sure to keep your eyes open on your walk. You might see a seal or two. Check out Lewis Revival for all kinds of treasures. The staff is extremely attentive and cute, and they have a fantastic selection of enamelware dishes that are super boat friendly. Or stop into EJ Design for a beautiful map to remember your time here. Now you may be asking yourself, is Stornoway always so calm and sunny? To which I have to say, no, definitely not. But the marina is extremely protected and we have felt comfortable both being on our boat and leaving it there in all kinds of weather in all seasons. I hope you found this marina moment helpful. If you enjoyed it, please give us a thumbs up and I'd love to hear any comments and suggestions below. Happy sailing! What? Sun, rain, rainbow.